Thank you. So. Okay, so uh, 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 what uh, what we uh, 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 learned over last time? So we learned uh, the uh, OOP of uh, an adjournment of uh, um, momentum tensor with itself. Uh, uh, as uh, we can write it symmetrically. We learned uh, OP uh, of energy momentum tensor uh, with uh, the primary field. Or maybe, no, I, I don't want to write this formula, uh, probably, so we, probably everyone remembers it. Mm. And there, uh, 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 we uh, learned that uh, uh, if uh, there are uh, 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 three point functions of uh, 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 primary fields, or actually uh, not necessarily of primary fields, but uh, of fields uh, which uh, behave as primary uh, under uh, uh, under this uh, global transformations. Mm. Delta 2 of Z2, O delta 3 of uh, Z3. Mm. Uh, so, from the general uh, arguments, uh, this uh, uh, separate function equals to C1 to 3 over um, Z minus Z. Uh, uh, Z1 minus Z2 uh, times uh, uh, to delta 1 plus uh, delta 2 minus delta 3 plus uh, two other terms times uh, complex conjugated. And now I want uh, to uh, 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 show uh, 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 operator with uh, such an arbitrary dimension in this uh, free bosonic uh, uh, field. So, uh, uh, let us uh, check uh, how this formula appears uh, uh, practically. So, uh, we have uh, uh, a free bosonic field of this correlator, phi of z, phi of w, equals to uh, uh, minus uh, uh, mm, two log i from r squared times z minus w squared, mm. and uh, uh, so pairing. Uh, let us uh, uh, compute uh, the correlator of uh, some number of uh, uh, exponentials of uh, this field, namely uh, i alpha phi of uh, alpha 1 phi of z1 times e2 i alpha n 
uh, phi of uh, the n. Uh, uh, so, uh, 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 we are uh, dealing with, with the uh, Gaussian integral. Uh, so we, we can say that it is. Uh, so first, uh, we can say that it is uh, uh, e to i um, i okay. i alpha one phi one uh, of uh, I of z1 plus uh, I alpha n phi of uh, z n. But you know, if if it is uh, uh, some uh, expression value under the uh, Gaussian integral, it equals to like uh, 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 who can tell? Uh, 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 what it is in terms of uh, um, uh, uh, expectation value of a squ square of this expression. Mm, of, uh, uh, it's almost incorrect. Uh, And because uh, let us check uh, the first non trivial term. Uh, if we expand this exponential up to the second order, we get one half. Uh, so it will be one half, uh, one plus uh, one half uh, times this uh, uh, operator squared. So if you want uh, uh, it uh, to uh, coincide with the right hand side, uh, 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 we should uh, put uh, here one half. Right. So, uh, uh, so in this way we get a variance of all these fields in the exponential. It will be e to uh, one half a uh, sum of uh, uh, k n. Mm. Alpha k, mm. alpha n uh, minus one half uh, because of i squared uh, logarithm of uh, r squared over z minus w squared. Mm. Uh, so it, it can be written as uh, 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 product over uh, Kn uh, let us uh, if first I write it naively uh, this Z Minus W uh, over R. Oh, oh, uh, so, so, so the case N. The N. The K minus the N over R to of K of N. Mm. Uh, Over two times uh, complex conjugate. Uh, 
But now uh, we see that uh, there are terms where k equals to n, and uh, they can be either zero or infinity. So uh, uh, we should uh, uh, introduce. Uh, so uh, initially we had infrared regularization, and uh, here we should also introduce uh, ultraviolet regularization. Uh, so we should define that uh, phi of uh, uh, z, uh, phi of z. Uh, is a uh, uh, logarithm uh, of uh, r squared or r small r squared. Uh, if we do this, and then this uh, correlator uh, turns into mm, mm, an actual uh, product without uh, um, uh, without these terms, product or k with them n. Z k minus z n to alpha k alpha n times uh, product over k. Over diagonal terms, R to minus uh, uh, R to plus uh, alpha k squared over two uh, times uh, this uh, term with a big R times R to a minus one half mm. sum uh, 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 sum of, uh, of a squared uh, times uh, complex uh, conjugate term. So mm, there is a uh, 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 there is a, a UV a regular a regularization. There is a IR regularization. Uh, and uh, uh, now, uh, what is the role of this uh, regularizations? Um, so we see that uh, this one has a form of product over uh, all these fields. So it makes sense uh, to define the new field. Uh, which is uh, denoted uh, like alpha phi of z normally ordered. It is uh, by definition uh, r to alpha k squared over 2 minus alpha k squared over 2 i alpha phi of z. Uh, so uh, uh, it removes uh, these terms, they can be included into fields, into these fields. And, uh, actually, this normal ordering is a little bit different uh, from the normal ordering, which is a uh, creation uh, 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 operators to the left, annihilation operators to the right. Uh, 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 um, because of this uh, IR regularization, but uh, it does not matter. We can just think this way. Mm. And uh, uh, so, if you compute uh, the correlator of normally ordered operators, Then uh, uh, we give, uh, 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 then we get uh, this product, uh, k less than n, the k minus z n uh, to of k of n uh, times uh, r uh, to uh, minus one half uh, sum of alpha of i is uh, squared. And uh, 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 now remember that this r should go to infinity. And it means uh, that uh, this uh, 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 correlator uh, 
uh, is uh, zero uh, when uh, sum of alphas uh, is uh, different from zero. Uh, it is just zero, and when sum of alphas, uh, uh, then it is a product of k less than n uh, the k minus the n uh, to alpha k of n. So uh, uh, we uh, obtained uh, 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 as an example of a field uh, with uh, uh, dimension. Uh, by the way, what is the uh, dimension of this field? And the pair of dimensions. Who can compute delta of alpha, delta bar of alpha? One do they equal to? Hmm? Uh, what do you mean by alpha one? It's uh, no. Uh, uh, how to find the dimension? Uh, we should compute uh, the correlator of uh, of two fields uh, with uh, 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 with the same dimension. So in this case, uh, this uh, by the way, it's called scanner condition. So, uh, I alpha phi of uh, z minus I alpha phi of w, this correlator, it equals, uh, according to this formula, uh, uh, to uh, what? Uh, to uh, z minus w to alpha squared. Uh, times uh, uh, complex conjugate. Hmm? Uh, minus alpha squared. Thanks. And uh, we know uh, from the general uh, theory, we, we studied it uh, last time. So there is this formula for three point correlator, and there is also a formula for the two point correlator that O delta of Z. O delta of W uh, equals to Z minus W to the power to uh, two delta uh, minus two delta. So comparing uh, uh, times uh, Z minus W to power minus two delta. Uh, z bar minus w bar minus 2 delta bar. Right? Uh, it can be obtained, for example, from this uh, 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 formula by putting delta 3 equals to 0. So uh, if you compare these formulas, uh, then uh, uh, what are the dimensions of uh, this exponential field? Mm -hmm. Yes, and the second dimension is the same. And uh, Actually, uh, uh, as far as we see this uh, factorization of the correlator, uh, it is possible to um, uh, kind of uh, split uh, this uh, field uh, into a product of uh, two. Uh, so uh, at this moment uh, it is done uh, formally, but it can be done uh, in a more rigorous uh, way uh, in the operator formalism. We can say that uh, 
uh, e to uh, i uh, alpha uh, phi of z z bar is uh, e to i alpha phi of z times uh, e to i alpha phi of z bar. We find bar of z bar, and we can uh, uh, consider this field uh, uh, separately. Yes. But in the regularization, you just insert the input in the right? Uh, yes. So why does it depend on that? Oh, because uh, if you want uh, uh, to. Uh, 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 if you want to uh, regularize uh, this uh, operator uh, by um, uh, by removing uh, all the self pairings, uh, the only uh, function we can get, uh, get is uh, this uh, green function of uh, all the field with, with itself. So if we uh, perform a standard normal order, we will have uh, here r over big R. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, the problem is that, uh, mm, no. Mm. The question is, uh, what uh, precisely are you removing? Are you removing uh, the whole uh, 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 correlator uh, uh, r squared or over a small r squared, which happens if you uh, use a normal ordering, or you remove only the singular part, which is uh, r small dependent? Yes, yes, because when people uh, write uh, these uh, dots, it uh, uh, often uh, means uh, uh, a normal ordering in the uh, operator formalism where uh, all uh, creation operators uh, move uh, to the left and all annihilation operators move to the right. Uh, um, and it's a bit different. And actually, in this case, uh, this uh, field uh, also has a zero mode uh, and a conjugate variable. And it is a, a, a bit unclear what uh, to do with them. So we should uh, fix uh, some uh, uh, normal order of coordinated and momentum. So, so b because this field is massless, it has zero mode, uh, which behaves uh, like a free particle. Uh, well, uh, you mean uh, with this uh, R? Hmm? Ah, so in this case, uh, we will uh, have uh, 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 some uh, uh, R. Uh, we will have a big R uh, instead of the small R, and we will need to uh, define uh, our fields of this uh, infrared uh, realization. So, mm. 
Esa es la idea. We have our big R squared here. Because, yes. Because, like, as Dad was saying, conservation of the condition basically. And when mm -hmm. the, the sum of the charges is not, uh, not zero, then uh, they mm -hmm. will have one. Uh, it will be not so obvious because uh, uh, all, all these fields will be scaled by some infinite uh, factors, which are uh, uh, r, uh, big R to alpha k squared. So imagine a formula like this. Uh, it is uh, quite. I mean, I don't know, maybe it's even wrong, but like, I, I have to consider like what happens if you, the polynomial in this point, if you see what happens, then it has to pass in the middle. And uh, uh, for example, uh, when we consider just uh, two alphas, uh, it will be. Uh, 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 so uh, alpha squared uh, would cancel, and uh, we would have r to minus one over two uh, alpha one times uh, no, we would have r to minus uh, alpha one alpha two, and it is something strange. When they have the same sign, uh, uh, it would go to zero, or otherwise it would go to infinity. No, it, it is uh, a bad idea, probably. <laughs> Yeah, so, but uh, usually uh, people uh, forget about this and fire the regularization immediately. Uh, they say that, uh, uh, okay, uh, this uh, scanning condition should hold, otherwise the uh, correlator is zero. Uh, and uh, uh, they, and uh, uh, we don't even care about this uh, r in the correlator of phi. We just uh, put a uh, big r equals to one. So. Uh, anyway, uh, nothing should depend on uh, this uh, infrared regularization, so we can uh, uh, remove it, uh, but uh, remember about this uh, scanning condition. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And also this uh, uh, scanning condition can be obtained uh, from the world identities. Uh, uh, I'm going to, uh, I'm also going to show on this. Mm. Okay, so, uh, so, uh, so uh, here we see a, an example of uh, uh, of a theory where uh, we can compute uh, uh, basically a, a all correlators, and it's of course not surprising, uh, surprising because uh, the, the theory is uh, Gaussian, which is a bit surprising in that. Uh, uh, we have uh, fields with uh, arbitrary dimensions. And by the way, concerning uh, the physical uh, meaning of uh, these dimensions, uh, 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 this is it. Uh, ah, so actually, uh, here again, first times complex conjugate. The meaning of this dimension uh, um, of uh, field in CFT is uh, energy is uh, the energy dimension. Because here, this exponential was a dimensionless uh, field. Dimension, like engineering dimension of pi uh, was uh, zero. And here, we uh, multiplied by meters uh, to, min uh, to a minus delta. So uh, it's like electron volts uh, to delta. So, mm. Um, because of this regularization, uh, 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 a field uh, uh, has a uh, uh, non-trivial uh, uh, physical dimension.
we can actually uh, uh, play uh, 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 for a while and uh, see that uh, uh, if you consider the uh, correlator of uh, three such exponentials, uh, uh, we will get uh, mm, uh, 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 we will get uh, this formula, but only for this uh, constrained uh, set of uh, alphas. So, um, yeah. So, so uh, at the moment uh, we see that there are such uh, fields, uh, but uh, uh, we, uh, 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 for example, we don't know if there are primary fields uh, or not. Uh, and uh, uh, one way to uh, check if they are primary or not is uh, to uh, try to compute OP of, uh, of the energy momentum tensor uh, with them. Uh, and it's of course computable because uh, we can uh, take uh, two exponentials, expand them as a series in alpha, get uh, two phi's of uh, z1, z2, then take derivatives and then gather them together. And uh, since we know the answer for the correlator, we can compute uh, the OP of t with such an exponential. Mm. Or we can use a, a, a Taylor expansion of the exponential uh, to compute this OP. But uh, I actually uh, don't uh, like uh, this idea. Uh, uh, I, I would uh, like uh, to exploit uh, uh, another fact, uh, namely the fact that uh, in uh, in this case, uh, this uh, theory of uh, free boson has uh, another uh, homomorphic symmetry. Uh, so, uh, namely, the action is uh, uh, is uh, integral or d to z d phi d phi d bar phi. Uh, with some coefficient. And uh, it al allows us uh, to uh, shift uh, phi by uh, some homomorphic plus anti homomorphic function. Plus a uh, phi plus a of z plus a bar of z bar. It's symmetry. Uh, uh, now, uh, on the question, uh, what would the conserve, uh, conserve current for such symmetry? How to see it immediately from the action? Yes, we can say that they are formally independent. I know. Uh, 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 why? Uh, uh, so, um, uh, equations of motions are d d bar phi equals to zero. So it's, uh, it's symmetry. So, uh, uh, so there was this technical uh, prescription of uh, how to uh, uh, compute uh, uh, the uh, integral of, of motion. So uh, uh, suppose, let us consider just one uh, 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 homomorphic part. So we say that uh, what this uh, A depend on uh, both homomorphic and anti-homomorphic uh, Z. 
and uh, um, a, a compute uh, s of uh, a phi plus uh, a of z z bar equals to what integral d to z what we had initially defined the bar phi plus uh, a da times uh, d bar phi plus uh, a d bar a d phi uh, uh, then integrate this term by parts twice in the end the bar the phi in the bar phi plus uh, the bar a times uh, d phi uh, and uh, you see when uh, a is holomorphic uh, then uh, uh, this uh, uh, term uh, uh, vanishes uh, identically. Uh, uh, when uh, uh, and uh, but uh, uh, the general uh, theory of uh, the integral of, of motion uh, tells us that uh, the operator which stays here is a conserved current uh, uh, corresponding to this form of symmetry, which is J of Z. Is, is it clear why? So for example, is, is it clear uh, why uh, this uh, current should necessarily be uh, homomorphic on the equations of motion? Oh, no. so, so uh, we know that uh, ah so uh, yes if we say that uh, it is uh, we are on the equation of motion that uh, then it is true for any a uh, and uh, then we can just integrate by parts and parts and uh, get uh, the bar z so it is it offer any a and, uh, uh, and the the fact uh, that we only have uh, the bar of a not a itself uh, is uh, because uh, a was homomorphic uh, symmetry so in principle we could get another term with da but uh, we don't get it because uh, and because uh, this transformation is a symmetry is it is it fine So, so this um, a practical prescription how to uh, compute uh, integrals of motion. So, as a result, j of z is uh, i d phi and j bar of uh, z is uh, uh, i d bar phi. Actually, I didn't know. If uh, if one has to put some, oh maybe yeah, this is fine. So, uh, any questions or? That's fine. So, uh, yes. 
Uh, actually, no, it is some form of procedure. Uh, uh, it is not true that we can uh, uh, split uh, uh, the field in the Gaussian integral into uh, these two parts because it will correspond uh, uh, to. Uh, it will mean that uh, we integrate over this saddle point solution in the. Gaussian integral, and it, it is something strange. It should be actual, the actual Gaussian integral. This is uh, some equality at the level of the operators. Because we see that correlation functions of uh, all these uh, uh, fields uh, factorize, uh, then uh, it is uh, natural to suppose that uh, there exist uh, such uh, operators uh, that uh, uh, this uh, composite operator is a product of two. Ah, but uh, yes, yeah, there, there are uh, two different things. Uh, there is a Gaussian integral uh, with a, uh, uh, with a, uh, some uh, basic uh, field uh, phi over which we should uh, integrate. And uh, uh, there is also operator of insertion of uh, 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 the exponential of this field under the correlator. And there are different uh, things. If uh, we have, if we see some effective behavior of, of uh, uh, this operator of uh, insertion, it does not mean that uh, uh, and the same formula should uh, uh, hold uh, for the uh, basic field in the pass integral. Like, uh, it's not the actual, but in the end, once I, I get what is the operator constant of the theory, I can mm -hmm. do not something like that. Yes, of course. So, because so if I will keep the, the operators here of the previous terms, in some sense, I get around the mark and I'm going to solve them. Yes. And the only question is uh, what to do with constant, because constant is uh, 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 a kind of uh, part of both of these operators. And this uh, phi uh, contains uh, a constant part, the operator phi. And, uh, it's a question uh, what uh, what to do with this constant part. So if I'm able to say I'm able to do a decomposition in sense and mm -hmm. take away the, the, the constant part, then mm. it will be homomorphic. Mm. No, it's homomorphic even with a constant part. It's just a question uh, which uh, part of this field uh, this uh, constant part should belong to. But maybe it's better uh, to, uh, to return to this point when, uh, when we start to do something with the Hilbert space. Because uh, 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 it is uh, easier to think at uh, the level of uh, operators uh, than at the level of, the, of something which is inserted under, under the pass integral. Yeah, so, so, so we have uh, this uh, uh, field uh, uh, J, and uh, um, uh, we can uh, remember that uh, the one this uh, uh, conformal valid identity, which uh, tells us uh, what uh, to do uh, 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 when we want to transform uh, uh, our 
field. And uh, word identity says uh, what? That uh, uh, integral over uh, integral around w of uh, dz over 2 pi uh, over 2 pi i j of z uh, times uh, all alpha of w uh, equals to uh, uh, epsilon of z and let us write a, a of z g of z uh, Oh. Oh. Let me go let me substitute in this exponential. Oh. 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 So this uh, should equal to the transformation of uh, 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 of uh, 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 this exponential. Uh, namely, we have e to the i uh, alpha phi of z plus a of z, and uh, uh, it equals uh, to e to the i alpha. A of Z, uh, phi of Z, plus uh, I alpha A of Z uh, times uh, E to the uh, I alpha phi of Z, plus and so on. Right? So uh, this exponential uh, is uh, multiplied uh, by uh, a of uh, by a of z in the first order. Right? So. If you write um, this conform of our identity, then we get uh, uh, i alpha a of w e to the i alpha phi of z. Mm -hmm. Right? Uh, mm, oh, sorry, it's W. Yes. And uh, oh, probably let me write this I and then recover uh, recover all the normalizations. Uh, but uh, we have something like this, which means that in the left hand side uh, we have a, a first order pole. And uh, uh, we should have, uh, uh, so uh, uh, it follows from this uh, immediately that uh, uh, j of z with uh, e to the i alpha phi of w uh, equals to, uh, equals to what? Who, uh, uh, who can tell this?
Mm-hmm. No, why do I have it too? Uh, w because we are expanding around the second point okay. and, and there is a perfect and there is a charge alpha right uh, so I put with this eyes and so, and so on but uh, uh, to check that it is correct uh, uh, to check the coefficient we just need to uh, compute the first order uh, 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 correction, uh, namely, uh, so, so the first order uh, term in alpha is uh, alpha over z minus w, and uh, 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 here we have uh, uh, i uh, d phi of z times uh, phi of w uh, times uh, I alpha phi of w mm. and the uh, uh, correlator between phi and phi in this uh, logarithm uh, with minus sign when we differentiate it we get 1 over z minus w and the minus sign is cancelled by this i's so it is alpha over z minus w so uh, so the signs are correct, and, and all these prefactors. Uh, so, uh, <coughs> uh, now uh, we see that uh, uh, if uh, we uh, uh, consider uh, uh, if we uh, uh, consider an energy momentum tensor, uh, if we add another j of z, we will get only 1 over z minus uh, w squared in the uh, right hand side, uh, which means uh, that uh, uh, so, uh, which means uh, that uh, this field is uh, primary with dimension of squared over 2. Actually, I see that uh, uh, this canon condition uh, uh, follows naturally from this uh, 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 from this symmetry uh, because We have the scarlator. Mm. And uh, if we uh, uh, perform a transformation which is a globally defined transformation, uh, we, should, uh, we should choose A of Z equals to a constant because all other transformations uh, have singularities uh, somewhere. There is only uh, one uh, 
uh, homomorphic function uh, on a, on a compact manifold on a sphere or on a torus. So we can uh, we can uh, perform this transformation. And uh, uh, from one side, it should be symmetry because we just uh, shifted the integration variable. Uh, it, it should equal to e to the i of one pi of z one uh, e to the i of n pi of z n. And uh, from the other side, it, it equals to i uh, i a alpha 1 uh, plus, uh, plus and so on plus alpha n time the square later uh, so uh, some of the selfs uh, should be equal to zero And it can be derived in some other way. We can say that each of these files has zero mode, uh, and the integral over uh, e to the i uh, i phi zero times uh, alpha one plus and so on plus alpha n d phi zero. Uh, is a delta function of uh, alpha 1 plus, uh, plus alpha n times 2 pi. Right. So, Are there any questions? Yeah. So, so uh, uh, now, um, as, so uh, you uh, 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 remember when we were uh, uh, talking about an momentum tensor, uh, we could uh, define uh, uh, the action of uh, this energy momentum tensor uh, on, a, uh, on, a, uh, on the space of fields. Uh, we could write uh, the OP of uh, T with some uh, primary field uh, and it looked like uh, sum over uh, Ln uh, O uh, of uh, W over Z minus uh, W to N plus 2. Uh, we can do the same with this uh, account. We can say that uh, the OP of uh, no, Z W of W equals to the sum of uh, some uh, some other operators acting on the space of fields. Mm. Z minus W, and uh, this coefficient uh, here uh, is a dimension of uh, of the operator. Uh, which stays here. So, so that uh, uh, dimension of a n is uh, just n, oh, sorry, minus n. And uh, if we define the action on the space of fields in this way, we see that uh, a with n greater than zero acting on uh, e to the i alpha phi is zero, a zero acting on e i alpha phi is uh, alpha e to the i alpha phi. Mm. So it's a, 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 it's a eigenvector of a zero. And uh, uh, all uh, a negative uh, a's uh, produce some new operators. 
and uh, we compute this new operator uh, just uh, uh, by uh, uh, by uh, uh, taking uh, the op uh, of uh, uh, five when uh, uh, this exponential mm. namely mm. so do I want to do this Um, maybe uh, let us compute this action. Uh, actually, uh, so uh, if you want to compute uh, this OP, it is easier to compute uh, uh, first uh, OP uh, with some uh, OP of two exponentials, uh, e to the i alpha if you have 5w, it equals to uh, e to the, no, so it equals to z minus w uh, to mm, uh, epsilon alpha e to the mm, I, epsilon phi of z plus uh, i alpha phi of w. Uh, and now uh, these two fields uh, will not uh, uh, appear uh, between uh, themselves. Then we expand it to the first order in epsilon. Mm. So phi of z, uh, i phi of z was e to the i alpha phi of w uh, equals to Mm. log of z minus w mm. So, so it's normally ordered. And now we can differentiate this. So g of z, e to the i alpha phi of w equals to alpha over z minus w into the i alpha phi of f of w plus uh, uh, i d phi of z into the i alpha phi of w so, and, and as a consequence, uh, this first term contributes to the singular part of the OP. And uh, uh, if you want uh, to get uh, regular parts, uh, we can just uh, uh, expand uh, uh, this phi of z around the second point. Uh, plus, uh, uh, sum from k equals to 0 to infinity uh, 1 over k factorial c minus w to the power k
i is some, something like d in k plus 1 phi times uh, e to the i alpha phi of w. So we, he, he, he sees them. Uh, we can conclude that uh, 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 this uh, a ends, so this is the action of, uh, of uh, positive modes. And uh, negative modes uh, generate some new fields. Uh, Finally, we can read uh, 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 what uh, the fields are from this uh, from this uh, series. Um, so um, we can say that uh, a minus n A minus uh, n acting on uh, e to the alpha i alpha phi uh, equals to um, so probably it is d. And uh, I dn d n phi e, e to the exponential normally ordered. So, we see in this formula, so it uh, generates some uh, uh, new uh, uh, new operators, uh, which uh, uh, will uh, uh, not be uh, uh, primary fields uh, of, uh, uh, for this algebra. And uh, uh, so this is the section, and it's uh, of course a very natural question to ask: uh, uh, What is the um, uh, 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 what is the relation between uh, these operators acting on the space of fields? Uh, so, so for example, what happens if we first act with uh, some uh, uh, a minus n? Generate uh, this kind of field and then try to act uh, with uh, some other AM and uh, 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 see what happens. For example, what what is the OP of uh, J of Z uh, with uh, such new field? What are the transformation properties of this uh, field which flow from this OP? So. Hmm. So now I, I propose uh, to uh, compute uh, the uh, commutator uh, of uh, uh, of uh, the actions of uh, two uh, such uh, uh, operators on the space of fields. Mm. So. so are there any questions? in this moment. So is everything okay? Okay. 
Okay, so uh, 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 let us suppose uh, that uh, we want to compute uh, a commutator of. Uh, um, uh, well, uh, let us actually suppose that we have uh, uh, two uh, uh, currents uh, with, uh, with uh, uh, dimensions uh, delta one and delta two. Uh, so we have. Uh, uh, we have some field A, uh, A of Z, uh, and uh, we compute uh, OP of this field with some operator of W. And this is uh, by definition some sum of uh, A, uh, K, O over C minus W to uh, K plus uh, and delta A, uh, and uh, we have uh, some other operator B of Z, which uh, which uh, uh, can also act on the space of fields uh, uh, K O. Mm. W Z minus W to K plus delta B. So we see if if we have a uh, uh, mutually local fields, uh, uh, fields uh, that have integer powers in the in their uh, uh, OP, we can uh, define such uh, actions. Actually, even if uh, uh, these powers are non-integer, we can still uh, 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 write uh, such a formula with a non-integer delta shift uh, here. So it's quite natural that if we have uh, uh, some operator, we can try to act with it uh, on the space of uh, fields. So this, uh, there are two actions on the space of fields. So now the question: What is uh, the commutator between a a k and uh, a uh, and uh, b uh, b n And then acting on the field O. So, so how to compute this? Uh, we should write uh, that uh, the action of. Uh, so uh, let us first uh, compute uh, the action of A K uh, times. Uh, uh, B, B N on O. To compute this first action, uh, we need to uh, uh, take uh, uh, O P of uh, B with uh, O and uh, take a corresponding term of this O P. Uh, so it is. Uh, it can be written as uh, A K. Acting on uh, this operator, it is uh, integral over uh, d uh, dz over 2 pi i. And if we want a uh, term and number k, we should multiply it by z minus w plus uh, 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 1 plus k plus delta b. Right. Uh, uh, times. Uh, hmm? 
Ah, yeah, thank you. Uh, so, and, and this contour is, uh, uh, let us say that it, it, it is uh, close to W, like, uh, uh, Mm. Or maybe let us uh, uh, draw this uh, first contour. This is uh, C uh, C one. This is W. This is uh, this is Z. So we integrate a, a, a in a, a Z uh, 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 over the contour C1. Mm. And uh, here we have a B of uh, Z or O of W. Okay, now we do the same procedure uh, with the uh, 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 with the second action, uh, uh, we have uh, some operator which appeared uh, after uh, a colliding Z and W. Let me maybe draw this contour even uh, smaller. So this contour is uh, close to W. So we expand in Z, Z minus W. Uh, let me check that equation is on. So this is on the contour C1. Uh, uh, now we need to write uh, the second action. Uh, uh, so these two fields collided when Z goes to W. And uh, 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 now we should treat it as a, a kind of a single point. So the second contour should be of uh, a, a much bigger size. This is contour C2. And, uh, and this contour C2 is a contour, uh, is an integration contour uh, for uh, some other variable uh, for the field A. So it, it is integral over uh, C2 uh, dx, for example, over 2 pi i. Mm. Here we have x minus w, mm, 1 plus k plus uh, delta a. This second integral over C2 mm, is that over 2 pi i d minus w. Mm. And now the product of this three fields a of x, uh, b of z, all of w. Uh, but, uh, and contours are, are, are written here, so in this integral. So, but uh, now let us uh, try to compute uh, the section in the opposite uh, order. Uh, 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 let us use the same variable uh, variables to denote this and uh, see what is the uh, difference between these two integrals. The only difference is that uh, 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 now we first uh, integrate in uh, 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 we first integrate a and then integrate b. It means that the only difference is that these uh, two contours are uh, interchanged. So uh, this second action. Uh, B and 
AK acronym O. W is a Uh, in the same integral, but here it was C2, now it will be C1. dx over 2 pi i. Here it is uh, C, uh, C2, and z over 2 pi i. Of x b of z, uh, so uh, it is a uh, literally the same integral, but uh, contours of integration are these ones. So uh, here. We first have x variable, and this is uh, c1, and the uh, c2 is uh, for, uh, for z variable. Uh, and we want to compute the difference. Yeah. Uh, and uh, uh, to do this, uh, uh, we uh, 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 say that uh, let us uh, z uh, be uh, fixed. Ah, so uh, first of all, uh, the precise uh, position of this contour uh, contours does not matter. Uh, so. Uh, um, the only uh, thing that uh, matters uh, is uh, their relative position, that one contour is inside uh, of uh, uh, the other one. And uh, using this, we can scale them in such a way that uh, uh, like, uh, maybe in, in this case, yeah, we can rescale on these contours uh, like this. We say that uh, uh, C1 is scaled uh, to uh, position of C2. Mm. Uh, to say that Z goes uh, 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 over some uh, C. One prime, which is C two, and then uh, x. Uh, well, this is x, uh, and then x uh, will go over some other contour, uh, which is uh, C two prime. So if we do this, we see that uh, z integration in both integrals is uh, the same. It is the integral over uh, C2. But x integration in one integral is inside this contour, in the other integral it's outside. Uh, so mm, uh, if you want to compute the difference of these integrals, uh, probably maybe I will erase uh, this computation. So we are computing a k b n minus a n b b k uh, no no 
the NAK. Acting on the operator O. W. So uh, we can say that this uh, integral in Z2 uh, in Z is the same. So it is integral dz over uh, over 2 pi i uh, it's over contra c2 and a integral in uh, x uh, 2 pi i is uh, uh, in uh, mm, so it is x integration is a c2 prime minus c yeah minus c1 Uh, is x minus w to 1 plus k plus delta a hmm. z minus w 1 plus uh, n plus delta b and pro product of three Yeah. Okay, now the question is what, what is this uh, contour? What is its meaning? So, so let us draw, uh, uh, let us draw uh, all three contours uh, in one picture. So uh, have W, we have uh, 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 we have Z somewhere. Let us uh, draw it at some fixed point because uh, uh, we consider this integral for fixed z. And uh, now draw uh, this uh, contour c2 prime, which is here, and uh, uh, minus c1, which is here. Hmm? Hmm? Uh, what do you mean by swapped? But in the same, and they are just fields inserted under the correlators. We don't uh, 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 say anything about operator formalism, uh, about operators uh, uh, on the Hilbert space. We are talking about operators uh, which act on the space of fields. So, so uh, we should understand this as uh, just insertions of uh, fields uh, uh, under the correlator, under some path integral. So, uh, and of course they, they all commute. Uh, B of uh, no, B of Z of W. Mm. But uh, uh, you actually see the a prototype of this uh, order in the, uh, which appears because uh, uh, yes. Uh, so uh, uh, later, later I'm uh, uh, going to uh, tell about operator state correspondence, uh, uh, and uh, uh, this will uh, 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 so th there will be uh, the same computation uh, of the actions of uh, different uh, modes of the operators uh, on the uh, uh, Hilbert space of uh, theory. But, uh, mm. Uh, at the moment, uh, this is the action on the space of fields, and uh, uh, we can 
uh, understand uh, this uh, relations as the uh, relation uh, the level of the first integral. And, uh, there is some space of fields. Uh, we can uh, consider all OPs of these fields, uh, get some new fields uh, like like uh, this one. Then compute, uh, then uh, uh, compute another uh, OP uh, uh, already with this field. Get some other field, uh, and um, this uh, defines some action of uh, of uh, uh, this uh, local fields uh, on the space of all fields, and uh, um, uh, we want uh, to find the algebra structure uh, of uh, this uh, uh, of this action. Like, like to, to find uh, what the relation between this uh, curly L's, uh, uh, which uh, act uh, on other fields, and this curly L's, which appear in, the, in T of Z. Maybe it's a, 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 a bit unnatural, but uh, I decided to uh, uh, first tell this and then switch uh, to the Hilbert space. So. Mm. Yes. So, so, uh, ah, so okay. But, uh, concerning this uh, contours, so so you, you see, there is this uh, contour uh, control C two prime with plus sign C one with minus sign. And there is only one singularity between these two uh, contours. So we can uh, shrink them, uh, like uh, do like this. Well, they cancel, and uh, as a result, we go. Uh, uh, as a result, we get a uh, uh, first integral around z. Z x. Here it is. So. Mm, So it equals to uh, the integral over z, so z integral in, over control c2 pi i minus w uh, and this integral in uh, so this contour can be denoted as uh, C Z, and that, uh, or maybe, oh, let us just say that it is integral around Z. Mm. Dx over two pi i, mm. i of x, uh, b of z. Times uh, oh a of x b of z minus w Of W mm. and uh, uh, now uh, we can say that uh, uh, this uh, uh, term uh, depends. Uh, uh, this term can be uh, computed uh, using uh, uh, the OP between A and B, and it depends only on uh, uh, on the singular part of the OP. 
So we again see the same phenomenon that uh, they define an uh, a, a expression in the singular part of the OP. In this case, it defines uh, as uh, uh, the algebra relation between, uh, between uh, the modes of uh, A and B. So, so this integral should be computed uh, using OP. Uh, let, let me maybe write this explicitly because it's computable. So let us say that uh, this uh, equals to a sum of uh, a b and over Z minus W N. Some uh, some far finite uh, ah, no uh, sorry it's X minus Z X minus Z it is uh, computed at, at the point X. And uh, since uh, we need only the singular part of it, uh, we can uh, uh, say that the sum goes to uh, uh, the sum goes uh, from uh, one uh, to to n, depending on uh, what uh, the separators are. Uh, and uh, now compute this uh, z, uh, this uh, x integral. So, and then this term, and we, we need to differentiate it. Uh, so it equals to um, integral c two um, z over Two pi i is z minus w to one plus n plus delta b. Here should be one over mm, No, so, so, sorry, it is of Z. Okay, probably it's it's fine. So w and uh, uh, we can also compute uh, this uh, derivative. Uh, so what what it is? It's some 
So it's an from gamma of this uh, uh, n minus first per gamma uh, of this Mm. Oh, sorry. Actually, uh, I wrote uh, the, uh, around uh, around the, the signs uh, here because uh, we actually want uh, um, uh, uh, to get uh, 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 the, the residue uh, uh, for the storm. So all these ones uh, should be minus ones. Sorry. So this should be corrected. Uh, and minus one plus k plus um, this. Uh, uh, So it gives uh, uh, k plus uh, uh, delta a plus delta b minus 1. Mm. And all uh, of a double so, 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 so you see now uh, we uh, need uh, to take uh, the modes of uh, of these operators which appear in the uh, uh, sum from n equals uh, one uh, to n so uh, uh, we should take modes of these operators which appear in the uh, product in the OP of A and B and act uh, uh, with uh, uh, this operator uh, on uh, on the field uh, O of uh, W. So it, it is something like uh, mm, Oh, the, um, so dimension of this field is uh, uh, n plus uh, a, a, a delta a plus delta b. So probably it is n plus k. Mm. 
Uh, yes. Uh, oh, sorry. Oh, uh, yeah. And uh, actually, uh, not only I used the same variable, but uh, cancelled uh, at some moment. Uh, sorry. Yes. Uh, so it is uh, L minus one. Yes. Sorry. Uh, here there is L minus one is L L and here is uh, K plus L minus N K plus N minus L plus uh, all this. Uh, yeah, so it should be A B L and component a K plus N minus L hmm. times uh, this uh, Mm, this object. Uh, hmm? Because uh, we need only uh, a single part of the OP. Uh, because uh, uh, a regular part integrates to zero here. No, but we always have x minus w, and we can differentiate it uh, as many times as we want. So, so if k is uh, big enough, uh, then we have some trivial derivative of this term. Hmm? No, no, delta should be integer. Uh, yes. So, so uh, this action on the space of, uh, of local fields uh, is well defined uh, for, for the fields which are mutually local. Yes. Yes. Uh, and, and, No, no, no. Uh, 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 we can define uh, this action on the specific local fields even if uh, uh, A and B are non local with respect to O. We just uh, take two operator uh, uh, expansions and say that uh, let us uh, uh, let them be the action. Uh, then, uh, uh, if we want uh, uh, to uh, compute the commutator of uh, these actions, uh, uh, we should have a locality of A and B between uh, themselves. Because uh, the only thing uh, which matters is that uh, this OP should be computable. Mm -hmm. No, uh, uh, because it's a local property of fields A and B. They can be non-local with some other operator O, but uh, they should be local uh, uh, between A and each other. So, uh, a, a correlator uh, of A and B should be uh, well defined. Uh, or, 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 uh, let us consider some example.
uh, which uh, this one uh, yes and uh, we will not be able to compute uh, this commutator because uh, mm, if we get some branch cut so what, what, what should we do it will. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, but uh, if so, A and B should be uh, mutually local. So that uh, this expansion uh, has only finite number of uh, singular terms. So it's uh, actually some additional requirement uh, that uh, good CFT should have uh, only uh, only a finite number of uh, singular terms in, in the OP. Uh, but uh, uh, we can. Yeah. So uh, if the if A and B are mutually local, then there is this expansion, and uh, uh, but uh, these deltas uh, can be non-integer, so they can be non-local with a field O, but it's still fine. We will still have uh, su uh, such uh, 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 relation. Mm. So. Uh, but now, uh, let us uh, uh, finally uh, apply uh, this uh, uh, this formulas for uh, the two cases uh, that uh, we had uh, for the uh, 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 U1 current uh, for the free boson and uh, uh, for the energy momentum tensor. So. So, uh, 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 let us uh, compute uh, G n. Uh, uh, so, uh, let us compute a n and a m uh, components of uh, G act on the operator O. So, let me remind that uh, its OP with itself is a uh, 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 1 over z minus w squared. Mm. Uh, so, uh, it is a uh, uh, z over 2 pi i integral over dx over 2 pi i. Mm. And now, uh, z minus w squared x minus w uh, to power, mm, uh, so, so it was k, it was k and n. Minus two. Oh, no. Minus w to power k, z minus w to power n. O of w. Uh, uh, so in this first integral uh, in uh, 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 no. So it's a. Uh, yeah, and kx minus z squared. So this first integral in x uh, computes to yeah, uh, kx minus w uh, uh, to uh, power k minus 1. Mm. And uh, uh, then uh, Oh, z minus w to k minus 1. Hmm? 
So, uh, because now we have done the cards from all the sets, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, it, it, it gives uh, an integral dz over 2 pi i, uh, uh, z minus w uh, to k plus n minus 1 all of w, and it equals to delta k plus n zero all of w. So we see that uh, the separators uh, a, a k and a n uh, uh, commutator equals to k delta k plus n zero. This is a Heisenberg algebra. Uh, is, is it clear? Yeah. We can do the same with the uh, uh, with the ln and lm. So it will equal to uh, z over two pi i. Here the singular term one over x minus z c over two. Plus uh, uh, two t over z z minus w squared plus uh, oh, x minus z squared dt over z x minus z z minus w to power n uh, plus 1 x minus w uh, so k plus 1 uh, z minus w to power n of w and uh, again uh, the computer uh, this integral in x uh, so integral in uh, there is integral in x around z dz over 2 pi i so let us compute on this uh, so when we differentiate uh, this term we will get uh, just uh, k plus 1 then k then k minus 1 and we should divide it by uh, uh, 3 factorial by 6 and uh, also by this 2. So we get c over 12 k plus 1 k k minus 1 uh, z minus w to k minus 1 uh, plus uh, Two K two K plus one T of Z uh, Z minus W to K uh, plus uh, Uh, in the t of z, uh, oh sorry, uh, yeah, mm. z minus w in k plus one. Uh, so uh, if uh, uh, when I start to compute this integral, we get immediately that the first term is uh, c over twelve uh, a k k squared minus uh, k cube minus k uh, delta in k plus n zero 
of W uh, plus uh, oh, sorry in the last computation for uh, today No, actually we can uh, uh, compute this integral immediately because we see that it is a t of z times o of w uh, and uh, maybe uh, uh, yeah and uh, I, I don't want to integrate by, by parts uh, so uh, and there is a, yeah, a t and there is OP of dt. So let me uh, uh, use some uh, blackboard to compute OP of uh, dt uh, with the, the operator O. Uh, so dt of z uh, is a uh, 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 sum of uh, uh, minus sum of uh, n plus 2 l n o over z minus w to n plus 3. Well, I haven't given this one. Uh, So uh, here we get uh, 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 two k plus one uh, l uh, k plus n. Uh, and here, uh, using uh, this uh, uh, OP, uh, we get uh, uh, minus uh, uh, K plus N plus 2. L, K plus, K plus N, and uh, uh, that's all. Uh, so uh, we get uh, O. So finally, we get uh, uh, the commutator of that L N, L M is equal to C over twelve. Uh, uh, that would, K and N K cube minus K delta
โอ้Mm. Well, actually, there is one more commutator which you can compute. Uh, this is the commutator for L, mm, K, and the G N. But uh, mm, maybe you can just uh, write uh, what uh, what it is. Uh, it, it is. Uh, uh, Actually, forgot. Hmm. So it is proportional to GK plus N. And the coefficient is. Uh, Maybe two K minus N. So, sorry, I forgot uh, which precise coefficient uh, is uh, here. Uh, but it is uh, uh, th there is universal relation for all uh, fields of uh, dimension uh, uh, delta. So. So it's uh, uh, definitely k plus n. There is uh, definitely a uh, minus n here, and uh, there should be some uh, uh, coefficient. Uh, uh, which is. Uh, I uh, know. Uh, actually, it is this one, and just this. So, because uh, J zero should commute with everything. Uh, J J is A. Okay, so. Mm, Uh, 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 for, uh, for your attention. So next time I'm going uh, to tell uh, how to uh, make uh, this uh, uh, operators, uh, some operators acting on the Hilbert space and not on the space of uh, fields. And I'm going to tell about operator of states correspondence in CFP. Okay. Sorry for delaying. Yes.